Hey everyone, this is Russell with Geek.com, and we are taking a really early look at what the Cyanogen mod team is calling Focal. Uh, before we do that, let's take a look at the existing Cyanogen mod camera app. It's the same camera app that we see with the Android Open Source project, uh, the, the kind of vanilla camera app before Android 4.3 was released. You know, very simple buttons, very simple user interface not a lot in the way of bells and whistles. And if you're running CyanogenMod, you don't have Photosphere uh, because that's a proprietary thing from Google that, that they own and is closed source. Um, so, you know, it's kind of uh, a little on the plain side. But let's take a look at something new. This is Focal. This is a new camera app from the CyanogenMod project. And we've got an early uh, release of it here. We're just going to take a quick look uh, there's there's uh, some big differences here. This is the, the toggle menu here, and you can see that through the toggle menu, we can switch to the front-facing camera. Uh, we can switch to PicSphere, which we'll get into a little more later. Uh, we can switch to video recording. We can switch to panorama, and we can uh, switch to the normal photo app. And this is kind of like Google Now, where you can just kind of thumb up and, and take a look. Uh, we can focus pretty much anywhere. We can We can tap in different places if we want or we can drag and focus in one very specific place and the camera will focus in that. We have a slide in menu now, which is very nice looking. Uh, all the menu elements that we would need for a camera uh, from basic stuff like flash and HDR toggles uh, on and off to control of the ISO. You know, there's, there's a lot of flexibility here. We can enable uh, burst shooting where you just hold down the camera button and you can shoot, uh, you know, five, 10, 15, or, or an unlimited number of photos. Uh, the, the menus all pop out like this and are very nice, uh, and everything just kind of slides back away when you're done with it. Um, and all of this stuff is part of the new Focal app. Uh, so, you know, we'll, we'll thumb through here a little bit and we'll take a look at, you know, just kind of the, the basic features. You can slide away and keep some of the menu options available. Uh, let's take a quick look at the video camera because this is something that uh, is becoming popular with a lot of camera apps is the ability to take pictures while you're recording. And this is something that is also a part of Focal. You double tap whenever you're recording video and it will snap it up and put it in your gallery. Uh, you can do this anytime you're recording in the front or in the uh, you know rear facing camera or the front facing camera and it will work either way. It's very, very simple. Now, when you're in this menu, you can also, you know, slide up and hit any of the toggles. You can flip over, you know, back to the camera. Uh, and if you take a look, you know, you can hit this from any direction. So you can, you can slide this open. And the Google Now slider makes it really easy to take pictures with either a single hand or, you know, holding it two hands here in landscape. So it really supports either way. And that's a really comfortable way of doing it. You, you can take, you can press and hold. Uh, and then again, you can slide in. You've got access to all of the menus uh, on the bottom there, whether you're holding the phone so that the camera is in your left hand or the shutter button rather is in your left hand or your right hand. You have control either way here. Uh, when you take pictures, you can actually take a look at your preview here. Instead of a single giant preview that you have to slide through, you can actually thumb through uh, tiny thumbnails and take a quick look at the things that you recently took. Uh, if you take HDR photos, you'll see the uh, different exposures that were taken and then the final stitched together uh, exposure shot. So let's take a quick look at PicSphere. This is a totally open source version of Google's Photosphere uh, that has been made specifically for this uh, application. This is something that's going to be open source, but for right now it's, it's only available in Focal. And it's, it's the Photosphere that you know and love. It's definitely a little different. You, you line your camera shot up with the, the dots and you follow along the dots. It will take pictures and then when you're all done, it'll stitch them all together. And, you know, when it's finished, you get a photosphere that is, you know, very, very similar to what you've seen with uh, Google's Nexus photosphere. Uh, but this, uh, this feature here isn't totally done, so I can't show you a complete photosphere. Uh, just like the panorama in, in this uh, isn't totally finished, so we can't show you that. But this is uh, Focal. You know, it's, it's going to be new in CyanogenMob. We're going to have Nightlies out soon. And it's a really great start. Thanks for watching.